think uh, using digital frame matching, especially with C4, has given us a lot of extra market share by freeing up time. We just had a company meeting and we went over balance. And having anyone from executive level all the way down having a little extra time in their day to do something other than just get on the phone and grind by them releasing our loads the minute they're built on the board, using the pricing engine, not manually typing in loads. It really frees up a lot of time in our day to do really whatever you can to get more loads on the board, right? Chase revenue, chase margins. So that's uh, really how we're trying to get a piece of the market share. Well, I'd be a liar if I didn't say I was a little against it when we first started. I kind of got it forced on me. A little bit more of the old ops, kind of post things on the load board, start grinding. But, you know, then sooner or later they start booking a load for you. Then another one. Then you find a repeat carrier. So, from that old mentality of just kind of coming in, you plug on your phone, you start talking to everyone, burn yourself out, as to opposed to now, where my day is watching carrier offers come through, trying to find a repeat carrier, trying to build a relationship off of the carriers that C4 and Cargo Chief have brought me. You know, it's, it's, it's been a lot smoother and a way less stress, so. I love the layers, and especially about the layers, I love that you can kind of peel them back as you go. If you want to go into just looking into that hidden capacity, which is one of my favorite parts, finding a carrier that I have no idea that exists out there that is interested in my lanes, runs them maybe for another broker or runs them direct, and now I have uh, access to that. Whereas the pricing engine has mixed in with that where I literally have to do nothing besides put a load on the board and it's offered to a carrier at a price that you know I'm okay with. Really has helped free up the time to find margin and revenue, which is why we're all here, right? So the layers have helped and I really like the flexibility of being able to use one layer at a time or use them all together. It's, uh, it's, it's been great. So I love the rating solution. I mean, everyone uses normally a few of them to try to dial in, get as most data as they can for their rates. I found the Cargo Chief's ranges from min to max is very accurate to at least get a load, maybe get a chance to quote another one. And carriers don't seem to give as much pushback as maybe one flat rate sent out there where you're just kind of dipping your toe into the market and seeing where they kind of come back at. So the rating engine, I... Uh, I've been a big fan of and the carrier offers I actually like to do them manually as well as having them auto sent out I think it uh, gives employees a great chance to build relationships by doing them manually as well as having them you know you can direct them to the carrier that you want maybe make a friend that you didn't think you could make before so I actually like the manual as well as the automated offers being sent out I think it's a uh, a great system for that. Uh, new carrier relationships have been phenomenal. We have seen an increase on probably 30% of our loads on getting at least action. The, the best thing about these carrier offers coming in is even if they don't like your rate, they want more money, it, it gives me a free window in to start a negotiation that I didn't have before. It's an extremely warm lead. They've responded to a lane that now I know they're interested in. And I, I, yeah, I would say 30% 30, 30 of our loads now are getting action and being a little more tailored towards the C4 direction. So, and it's, it's been great. We've really enjoyed the partnership with C4 and Cargo Chief.